It's Thursday, February 22nd, 2012, and here is New York. I'm currently inside the Museum of the City of New York on 5th Avenue and 3rd. I've just seen the exhibit the yeah, the Greatest Grid on the Commissioner's Plan, 1911, which is celebrating its 200th birthday this year. And it's a truly incredible exhibit. Um, just some of the things that came to mind, the fact that huge plots of land that were owned by the Astors and Archibald Gracie, which was the namesake of Gracie Mansion, how that was turned, such large farm plots north of what was then North Street, now is Houston Street, how it turned into this massive block by block grid is truly incredible and required a great deal of bureaucratic financial and geological efforts. The way that the maps show the change in New York City over time from farmland to blocks to super blocks and then back to blocks again, it shows how incredibly the city has changed. The exhibit it still shows Bloomingdale Road instead of Broadway. It still shows the Croton Reservoir rather than the main branch of the New York Public Library, which itself is celebrating its 100th birthday last year. From 1835, at that point, the West Side still stopped at 11th Avenue. It had only 12th Avenue was only between the 105th and 135th Streets, and today it spans the entire length of the West Side of Manhattan, and there's a little extension to the west of that, Nuts River Park. Human interaction with the island is incredible, which is further established on the second floor. And the I'm currently looking at right now, um, this is just a blank wall. I don't even know what the hell they use in this room, why this gallery isn't being used for this exhibit, uh, called the Unfinished Grid, with designs from urban planners and artists on how the grid system of Manhattan can be improved. So I highly suggest you check it out. Put more information on these exhibits down below. I'll see you all tomorrow.